You're watching Good Morning Kentucky with Lee Cruz, Haley Harmon, and your forecast with meteorologist Dylan Godet. ABC 36 on your side. All right, welcome back. Time for Tuesday Trivia. Now, today's questions are in honor of today's International Cat Day. That's right. So if you're a cat lover, this quiz is for you. You better play along at home. You're going to get them all right. We, neither one of us have cats, so we hope we do okay. So, oh, it's not, it's not the University of Kentucky Wildcats. It's just domesticated cats. I, I know. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'm so sorry. Our quiz master today is Matt Montgomery from eCampus.com. Matt, good to see you this morning. Good morning. Stick around. At 9 a.m., we're going to sit down and talk with him about eCampus.com, what it's all about, and how you could utilize their amazing, amazing services. Right now, though, you are our quiz master. Are okay. you a cat fan? Do you have a cat at home? Uh, we have cats. I don't like cats. Oh, <laughs> I understand. Wow. Well, then that's a tough way to... Yeah. Tough way to go for you at the house. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah. Wait, all that's right. all right. Here we go. Question Let's one, Matt. Hit us with the first question. Okay, who were the first people to own cats? Mm. The Greeks, the Romans, the Egyptians, or the Nigerians? Oh, no. All right. Can I say those one more time? Sure. Greeks, thank Romans, you. Egyptians, or Nigerians? Oh, thank you. Did You're you welcome. write this question? That's what I guessed, too. We said C. Is that is correct. Yes! Egyptians. Uh -huh. Those Egyptians. Yes. Oh, uh, uh, wow. Okay, good. We're off to a good start. I like it. Okay. Uh, question two. Who's the famous comic cat who's always eating lasagna? <gasps> okay. Oh, my gosh. I haven't we thought of this cute little grump in so long. Garfield. Garfield. Wow. You guys are doing great. All I right. have not thought of him. I'm actually very shocked we got that right. He's right. a good dude. All right. What's your cat's name at home? I just got to know. Don't, don't, don't. Oh, don't even make you talk about it. It's <laughs> too right. painful. I understand. He doesn't even know what his name is. There's several, so. You uh, may need to call an exterminator. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'd say his partner would beg to differ. <laughs> what, <laughs> what is a technical term for a cat's hairball? Driblet? Bezoar? Crumble? Blop. You're telling me one of these is the correct answer? One of these is the correct answer. These were all my nicknames in high school, too, oh, by the way. Yes. Every one of these. Here he is, the Carlisle uh, Dremblet. Yes. <laughs> oh, wow. The Clark County Blomp. Here he is. I, don't, I have no idea. I, I, have no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I do don't this. even know what they I'm, I'm going to I'm just going to write. Yeah, I'm just going to. Well, that's what I did. Okay, B. I, You're both right. Hey! hey. We may do something unprecedented. You guys are cheating off each other. Oh, no. <laughs> no actually, have we not. everyone right today? We have. Matt, you're about to witness greatness. Uh, great. We're probably going to jinx ourselves. Yep. But we haven't missed one yet. This is we're, crazy. We're pitching we, a perfect game right now. Do we love cats? You need to have one. I'll drop one off. I knew it. I knew it. Okay, here we go. All right. True or false? Unlike dogs, cats do not have a sweet tooth. True or false? Unlike dogs. What? Cats do not have a sweet tooth. But see, the, is the unlike dogs a trick? Because well, do dogs, dogs have sweet tooth? Well, you know they do. They love pup cups. They'll all that eat stuff. anything. Well, that's true. Nothing's. No one is ever hungrier than a dog who has uh, just been fed. Okay. So the, the negative. Cats do not have a sweet tooth. Is that true or false? That they do not. That's what I'm saying. Oh, wait, cats do not have a sweet tooth. So, oh, uh, yeah, that's, that's what I'm oh, saying. Oh, they said they're We're trying to that. trick us. I don't yeah. know. We're both saying false. You ruined your perfect game. No! Yes. They don't have it's a true. sweet tooth. They do not have a sweet tooth. I've seen them lick stuff that's sweet. Oh, my God, man. All right. Anyway, all right, next question. Dang it. We were so on, good. On the record, how small is the tiniest full-grown cat in the world? Wow. On the record. Wait, what? On record, One and how half. small is the tiniest full-grown cat okay. in the world? All right, I'll just do this. I mean, Who are you talking to? You, I guess. Mm -hmm. We're going to say A. Nope, it's C. The so, smallest full-grown cat? Three I think that's heavy for a cat. What? Three pounds? I don't know. They stay trim because they don't eat sweets. All right. You see? Well, Matt, thank you for playing and being our <laughs> quiz master. We appreciate it. Again, we're going to talk with Matt about eCampus.com coming up in just a little bit at, yeah. at 9 o'clock. So That's stay right. I'm really proud of us. I think we did great. Well, until we call attention to our perfect oh, no, trip. That's, that's why they don't talk to a pitcher in the dugout when that's going on. We messed it up right here in the dugout. What a couple of blomps. Mm, yeah. Anyway, Matt, thank you, buddy. We'll you're see welcome. you here. We'll uh, see him again at 9 a.m. right now that we do have to take a short break. Stay with us. You're watching Good Morning Kentucky. We'll be right back.